Oh, look. There he goes. Go get you. Go get you. Go get you. Is that a... Yeah, it's a yeah, guillotine. It's a guillotine. Hmm. Ah. Didn't know they were French. Do you honestly think you're fu- Could you be any louder? Ah! <laughs> You, you really trying to trap yourself, dude? I had never noticed it before. I was wondering if it would go off if you stepped on it. <laughs> oh, f uh, slide. What? We're just guys being dudes, you know? We're just chilling. I'm a dude. He's a dude. She's a dude. We're You're a dude. You're a dude. dude. We're all dudes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. All, all I'm gonna say is just when I, I remember that Gillette ad from back in the day, you know the whole thing's like boys will be boys, like, and Gillette single-handedly just shot themselves in the foot for for just like such a, a like a mind-numbingly like ass-backwards portrayal of like not even understanding what people mean when they say toxic masculinity at all <laughs> yeah no and it's like oh toxic masculinity right it's toxic to like ever talk to a woman in public oh not only that it's also toxic <laughs> it's also considered oh, toxic behavior to uh, be able to walk down the street without being accosted I, I hate to say it but but you know i like i i'm afraid of being accosted every now and again whenever i'm out in the very bad place because because I've been accosted like I've had people like try and harass me for shit I had a crackhead one time like try and like like just like intimidate me into giving me giving me hit or giving him my shit and I'm like I'm like hell no and I just like I got away as best I could but honestly man I mean like I would say the biggest thing with the just a like, we we're men. We do dumb stuff. There's some dumb, dumb, dumb stuff that men have done. For instance, look at Jackass. That is that is quintessentially like dudes being stupid. And you know what? It's, it's funny. Hilarious. It's hilarious. And then of course, <coughs> uh, just guys being dudes. Uh, you know, uh, we we make funny videos where we do stupid stuff. I mean, you know, I remember. The one time where we did the hair like waving video with like the fan outside with Micah. That was just us having fun and being stupid and being silly. And just guys being dudes. That's how it, that's how it needs like honestly when we're just chilling, we're having fun. I don't see what the problem is. I mean, we're just having fun, right? 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 At, at least that's what I hope. So anyway, uh, we have uh, the MK video here. Just guys being dudes. Is this Octodad IRL? Oh boy. Anyway, here we go. Just guys being octopuses? Thought it was octopi. Never mind. Oh, yep, I've seen this one. Oh. <laughs> I'm always afraid to do stupid crap like this because I know I'm going to get in trouble. Cardboard tubes? What are we building? That is monstrous. Is that Dunky? <laughs> It looks like Donkey. Rob wants <laughs> to give you a high five. Get ready. Hey! Hey! Rob. High five. He's never where I am. My boyfriend's washing the dishes, and I just heard him say, Who do you work for? Who's your contact? While repeatedly pushing a glass underwater. <laughs> hey, what's wrong with that? He's living out one of his fantasies. Like, Who do you work for? Who's your contact? That's like, a fucked up fun? fantasy, yeah. though. Just walk past. It's funny. He's living out like his James Bond thing. Because that was in several Bond films. You know, him like in, intimidating them by like pushing them underwater. Like, Who does he work for? Four teenage just, boys. It, it come, uh, like a, I, I'm more likely to just be sitting there like... Where's the money, Lebowski? <laughs> it's down there somewhere. Let me take another look. <laughs> See? That's a dude response right there. A quintessential dude response. Just walked past four teenage boys trying to hit each other with a dead Christmas tree going... They hit each other with a dead Christmas tree going, Elden Ring, bro, Elden Ring. <laughs> Wife, why is there a charge for $3,000 to Men's Warehouse? Me? I have no idea. I'll go outside, though. 
<laughs> that is more than respectable. I love, love it. it. Look at that dapper motherfucker. Look at him. He's just he's just like, mm, would you like to take a ride, madam? Horskit's tailored three-piece suit looks absolutely dashing. I feel like that cost a little more than three grand. What do you think? Yeah. The girl wanted a piggyback picture on the beach, and a random biker watching the sunset said he wanted one too. <laughs> Hell yeah, man. Hi, this is DoorDash connecting to your Dasher for updates about your order. Uh, just waiting on the flatbread to come out of the oven. Cool, dude. Thanks for the update. You want a picture of a cat? Yeah, let me get a picture of the kitty cat. That's a pretty kitty cat. Vintage <laughs> land party. I understand why it's Hell called vintage, yes. but you didn't have to call it vintage. My my whole life has been leading up to this moment. No. <laughs> oh my God. No. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. uh, wow. Andrew moment. sent me that no. picture. He was like, check this guy out. <laughs> that is, like, this living dude the is living fucking the dream. best life. Yeah. The best life. Uh, a PS5, beautiful woman next to him, and a, a friggin' RTX 4090. My man, you are like. For some reason, I feel like it's his birthday and she probably bought those for him too. Yes. Dude, it's just the vibe I get. I would walk up the to him. The smile on her face, she's just like, I'm glad I get to buy my man the things he wants. So. I would walk up to him and I would just like, dude, it's like, dude, up top, up top. Like, or actually, you know, his hands are full. I would, I would just be like, I would look at him and be like, dude, you are living the best day. You are having the best day ever. Oh my God. Let's see. PS5, a well, an anime 4090. I don't know what that bag over there is. Hmm, this guy got some money. Seriously, lucky you. That's how big the 4090 now, is. Now, something I did, did just think of, though. What? That might not be his girlfriend. He might have just got a lot of money. And he might have bought that stuff as well as hired a young lady to accompany him for the, for you the day. But no, <laughs> so, you don't know that. Yeah, I know. But I was just thinking about it once I thought about all the products and stuff. I was like, but he, but she is really, really pretty. Like, and box. her outfits, They're... like you know, the sort of uh, kind of outfit that a companion might wear. Well. Honestly, who's to say that? Oh, who's to say, an they're, extra not, sexy who's to say they're not a couple? Who's to say they are not I'm a, just like, saying, a full fledged yeah, couple? Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm not saying them 100%. I'm just saying it could be the case as well. But. I know. <laughs> it could also be the case that, you know, she's puppeting him by like having his hand in it, having her hand in his back. I mean, that, that's a possibility. Seriously, yeah. lucky you. That's how big the 4090 is, by the way. Look at that yes, box. Yes, it's a They're chunker. They're just giving them away. Free large cardboard tubes. You can possibly deliver for bulk load. Yeah. I would. I, I would want some of those. I would definitely want some of those because you know, I'd. I'd want to build like a fort with them. I'd want to build. I'd want to build like a primo fort. So yeah, I want I want to paint one the same color as my room, uh -huh. and then just like find a way to securely attach it to the wall so the cats have like a tube to just go through up high on the wall. Oh, I think that'd be nice. Because <clears throat> like looking at those, I'm like I'm not sure exactly what I'd do with it other than like build something for the cats with it. And I was like, hey, you can make a cat tube with it. Mm -hmm. Garage. Just saw that. three undergrads in lockstep carrying a mattress on their heads like ants. I mean, can you think of a more efficient way to do that? <laughs> no. The Dodge Caravan turned into a middle school calculator. What? Oh, oh. Gotcha. This is the funeral of Private Kevin Elliott, who was killed during a battle with the Taliban in Afghanistan. The ceremony was held in Dundee, Scotland. His best friend, Barry Delaney, wore a green dress to honor a long-time agreement that if one of them dies, the other has to wear a bright green dress to the funeral. It's yellow. May just be the picture, like just not being having not having the right exposure. Yeah. But hey, that's dedication to where to like honor the agreement. That just makes me so sad, man. Oh, what a dude. Man allegedly bench presses goose for ten minutes at LA Park. Goose allegedly loves it. I mean, clearly. I noticed there was a blank wall at McDonald's, so I decided to make this fake poster of me and my friend. It's been up for 51 days. I wonder if it's still up to <laughs> this day. Emiliano Martinez during the World Cup. <clears throat> Is he alive? Is he okay? When she says she's into fit middle-aged guys. Hmm. Not guys from the Middle Ages, lads. In the bathroom at Wrigley. And there's a man on the phone with his mother. Hi, Mom. I'm peeing in a trough at Wrigley Field. Everyone say hi, Mom. And all 40 of us in the bathroom yelled, Hi, Mom! Bonding. Yes. Ah, 
I grew Man. up in a college town, and one Halloween our doorbell rang, and we opened the door expecting to see trick-or-treaters, but what was in front of our open door was another door, like a full-on wooden door that had a sign that said, please no. I was saying this so before. Did, and the door swung open to reveal a bunch of college dudes dressed as really old grandmothers, <laughs> colors in their hair and all, who proceeded to coo over our costumes and tell us we were such cute trick-or-treaters. <laughs> one even pinched my cheek. Then they gave us candy, closed their door, picked it up, and walked to the next house. <laughs> that is so freaking cool. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Those are the funny fuckers right there. Yes. <laughs> that is most definitely... I, they win Halloween. I don't mm -hmm. care what anyone says. They win Halloween. Well, they found a way to go trick-or-treating without really going trick-or-treating. You know what I mean? Like, they yeah. weren't taking candy from the kids or anything. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the walkers. Look at the knit, the knitted scarves. Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> and they are geniuses. Back in high school, <laughs> group of kids do nothing but talk like Hank Hill. I swear by God, that boy ain't right. Imagine a dozen frickin' Hank Hills have some anti-drug rally. Guy starts saying some reasons kids get lured into drugs. Kid raises his hand and says, Why do drugs when you can just mow a lawn? Group raises him by saying, Taste the meat, not the heat. He's gonna say, Why do drugs when you can just mow a lawn? Taste the meat, not the heat. Guy legitimately has no idea what to reply. Next questions it. Go! I've never act Bo actually heard guys introduce themselves. How do y'all find out each other's names? We actually just wait until we hear somebody else say it. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up real. It's usually if true. I forget someone's name when it's told to me. Well, no, let's be honest, because whenever you're introducing somebody, be like, hey man, uh, it's my friend, uh, my friend Nick. Like that's so. usually what it is. That's usually how it goes. And it's, it's, like, it's always a qu uh, it's sort of like a weird dynamic because sometimes I forget to introduce and they spend like an X amount of time talking to each other and then I remember, oh God, I never introduced them to each other. Well, there was uh, one of Quinn's friends at our party um, at one point and no one introduced us and like it was just... For the longest time, like, uh, like I was like, nobody's going to introduce me to this person. I don't know. So eventually I was like, hey, I didn't catch your name, by the way. And they're like, oh, yeah, it's this. So I was like, oh, I'm Nick. Nice to meet you. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I just wait until I hear it and then make an instant permanent mental note. My technician leaves me notes about things I should know before I enter a patient's room. I think my technician needs a raise. She is his wife, not daughter. As a gay man, <laughs> I was nervous to invite my boyfriend to my grandparents' house because of their traditional values. This was my grandpa's reply. Mom might have told you already, but my boyfriend is coming to dinner tonight. Hope that's okay. Splendid. Kenny arm wrestled. <laughs> Hell yeah, Grandpa. Hell yeah. Oh, man. And one time I accidentally went to the men's washroom instead of the women's. I only found out after I opened a pad and the person in the stall next to me said, Dude, it must be a huge crap if you're having snacks in here. Good luck. I choked on my water. There's a group of grown men in my neighborhood who ride around at night together on big wheels. Is that a problem? There's no problem here. What's the, what's the issue, my dude? Nothing. That's amazing. <laughs> I want to do that. I want to go out and buy a big industrial big wheel and just drive it around the cul-de-sac. It'd be even more fun if you get a group of that many people to do it with you, too. My yeah. friends and I sent Hell a selfie yeah. to the wrong number. Sorry, wrong number. Well, they seem to like it, though. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yes! Hell yes, dude. That is awesome. I like that they all did the same faces. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was so good. I was playing FIFA 19 with some random dude online, and he was using his headset and probably forgot to turn it off. So I was leading three to nil at halftime, and I heard him say, "If I win, will you sleep over?" And a girl replied, "Yes, but you won't win." Had to let the bro win five to three for the culture. Hell yeah, that's dude. When you have a rando online acting as your wingman, <laughs> dude. That's the best shit ever. Yeah. This is a scam. He got you again. Girls, ugh, she's wearing the same dress as me. Boys, these guys don't know each other. They literally sat down just because they were both wearing stripes. Blue guy walked in and stopped and was like, yo, stripes. And the red guy started nodding and was like, stripes. stripes. <laughs> I had to take in another dad's car to Costco and asked if he left any gas in it. 
He said half a tank, and then it was warmed up for me. That's all we said. Just two dads out here killing it. I said, hell yeah. The Spanish flag. He painted the Turkish flag and ran away. Interesting. Two dudes <laughs> finding the best reason to write a research paper. Let's see. The Cox Zucker machine is an algorithm created by David A. Cox and Stephen Zucker. <laughs> A few weeks after we met, we realized that we had to write a joint paper because the combination of our last names, in the usual alphabetical order, is remarkably obscene. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> Back in high school, my buddy and I really committed to the costume party. Yes, you did, and you're amazing for that. <laughs> 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 I would have made it better. So if you had some googly eyes, yeah, you had some googly eyes, and, and, and you like, and you like drew a nose on here. That's the only thing that would make it better. That is so good. That is amazing. My dude, you deserve. You deserve also an the award. the fact that they're shaking hands behind yeah. the back. <laughs> It's like, oh, yes. Yes, yes business. Uh, yes, yes. Uh, yes, very good. I like your tie. You too, sir. What color is it? I don't know. <laughs> Best urinal ever. Guitar P allows men to record tunes that are replayed for everyone in the restroom to hear. That's something. Uh, see, women? You don't get this. Remembering that time in grad <laughs> school when my really advisor, a great about. ornithologist, got a random call. Drunk guy. Bar noises in the background. Is this the bird, professor? Uh, yeah. Do hummingbirds have feet? Yes. Yes. Wild cheering over the phone from the bar. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually another phone. Yes! I have seen that. Dude, have you seen, like, the duct tape dudes? Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. I actually saw one at two parties. One at a pie lamb party and one at a pie cat party. The pie lamb party, uh, he was duct taped to a post that was on the ground, and he was duct taped standing up. Uh, and then the other one from pie, cat, from pie cat was hung from the ceiling. They, like, had, like, two things of rope around him so that he didn't fall, and then the duct tape was there with some pillows to like make it comfortable for him. So my whole question is what if you have to go pee? I guess uh I guess just pretend you're a camel and don't don't think about it <laughs> until someone cuts your ass down. <laughs> Photo of the duct tape guy or at least I hope this is the duct tape guy. You I think it is. It might be. Hold on. That month I think that is 100% him. Because he's even taped. No, right here. Look, it's the same guy here. White shirt, same haircut. White shirt, same haircut. Huh. This is just a different view. Nice. And also, look at the pillows. It's the same computer, too. Yeah, yeah. and look at the pillows. Blue, yeah. white. Uh, hold on. Blue, white. <laughs> It's just a I was gonna view. say he's positioned with the pole right at his right shoulder too. So. Yep. Also, white hat. Yeah, <laughs> dude. That like that is some next level shit. You know exactly who I'm talking about. Poland's highest ranking police officer has confirmed to local media that he accidentally set off a grenade launcher given to him as a gift by Ukraine. Okay. Huge gamer. <laughs> Have a workmate called Amir. Also huge gamer. Obviously we befriend each other within a week. Basically best friends. We decide to prank our non-gamer colleagues. Act and speak like NPCs from different games when we meet. Literally <laughs> word by word random oblivion chatter. Literally asked him if he went to the Sky District often. Last week, working normally, Amir's like three desks near me. Suddenly a huge bang is heard. Probably just a plane. Amir, by the gods, is that the voice? Fucking genius. By the gods, is that the voice? <laughs> Dragonborn! Just imagining that, like, it's just <laughs> amazing. I get fired for laughing and causing a disturbance at work, man. <laughs> oh. oh, God. Ooh, uh, breathe. <laughs> 
Dragonborn. We both break out laughing. I had to explain <laughs> to three HR ladies what we were doing. One is laughing her tits off, and the other two get angry and tell us to grow up. <laughs> oh, shut up, Karen. Get over yourself. Like, yeah, you two need to grow up. It's like, yeah, right. Shh. Going up to the prettiest girl in the bar and buying her a drink because she's my wife. Yeah! Never stop flirting with and or dating your significant others. May yes. seem like a weird thing to say, but it's true. Think about it. No, it is Gentlemen, true. I am here to tell you that I've cleaned and folded my clothes and towels. My covers are cleaned as well. I'm proud of myself. You've done it, my man. I grew up with this tube. 30 years later, it's my son's tube. Raise him right. What is with the tube? Hell <laughs> yes! Look at look at the little man back there. He's like, Daddy, Daddy, don't tear down my fort. It's like, I won't, son. I won't. Also, the yeah, these industrial tubes like or you know, uh, like cardboard tubes like this last forever if you take care of them. Tubes. Teachers seize disco equipment from 12-year-old boy who hosted rave in school toilets. Why? Oh, Caught red-handed. Gotcha, bastard. So many summers spent in the gaming garage. Oh, the gaming garage? What? So mm. I was just in the men's room, pissing. And a dude in the stall had explosive diarrhea. I, not being a robot, laughed. And the boomer, two urinals down, told me not to laugh. I said, bro, don't talk to me while my dick is in my hand. An explosive diarrhea guy laughed. Whole thing was just bizarre. <laughs> okay. I had a similar situation like this happen at Cheddar's. I went into the bathroom, and I thought I was all alone. I thought I was all alone, and I'm, I go up to the urinal, and I start doing my business, start handling, you know, just handling my business, and I had to fart, like, really bad. And I just let it rip, just... And then I hear from, I hear from two stalls, like, in, is like, dude, nice. <laughs> and I'm just, <laughs> I start laughing while I'm pissing. <laughs> and I'm just like, thanks, dude, I thought I was all by myself. He's just like, he, he's just like, ain't no problem, dude. I'm, I'm going to be here a while. Thanks for the entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, God, I love that, dude. I love it so much. Sounds pretty fun, though. I mean, a hilarious event. If you were in a room with other men, what topic do you think will start an instant discussion? What's the biggest animal you think you could take in a fight? I think the Hell right yes. guys to this prove it was the correct answer. <laughs> Yes. That is the truth. I love genuinely innocent boys <coughs> wearing boys. Just saw a guy come out of a frat house to poke a pair of jeans they had left outside. They were frozen solid. And as soon as he confirmed that, like 20 more boys came rushing out of the house going, Yo! Yo! <laughs> yes. Is the yes. spirit of boys will be boys. These dudes yes, saved their is. elderly neighbor, Mr. C, from a house fire. That's not even guys just being dudes. That's just... That's just great. That's great dudes being dudes. Hell yeah. That is awesome. Guys being awesome. That, yes. I mean, come on. Who says land parties are dead? I don't think anybody's really said that. Uh, Destiny, damn man, Jesus! And they're landing as of recently, aren't they? Dude, yeah. I'm like, who in the fuck had know. five friends that actually wanted to do raids with them on Destiny? You guys suck. I'm jealous. Achievement Hunter. Although it often with Achievement Hunter ended in assault raid because one person would get so pissed off about something and then would just like stop playing. And, uh, oh god, it was ugly. But dude, yeah, five PS5, PS4s, and j dude, this is uh, no six, six, because I I didn't see that one there. So yeah, I literally bought Destiny for one of my friends trying to get him to play it with me, and he never booted it up. <laughs> that sucks, dude. I'm <laughs> I was sorry. Like, you suck, dude. <laughs> you know, I would be down to do some stuff in Destiny too. Like most definitely, I would be down to do it. There's stuff like there's games. I'm not down to do anything in Destiny anymore because bunch of your fucking scumbags. Yeah, true. You're not support them anymore. Um, but I will say this: I will. I've bought Deep Rock Galactic, and I would be more than willing to join up with you and play some stuff with you. Hell yeah! Yeah, I think that'd be pretty fun. DRG baby. 
Yeah, come on, this is just the modern day equivalent, dude. It's awesome. Okay, yes, cardboard tubes are cool and all, but they're no match for my long sword. Jimmy for scale. Holy crap, that is one long oh. sword. Well, <laughs> this guy's truly ready for the land party. Honestly, though, those are gonna snap and he's not gonna be very happy. Yeah. New Year's shenanigans. Please don't do that. Please. No. No, Jesus. that's. That is dumb. That is stupidly dumb. Do not do this. Don't. Hilarious. These high school sophomores from Washington and <coughs> Oklahoma decided to take their yearbook photos in the exact same shirt. <laughs> Wait a minute, is there a town in Oklahoma called Washington? That strange decided to take their yearbook photos in the exact same shirt they literally <laughs> took off this shirt and kept passing it down i think it's the greatest it is actually quite fun that's I awesome that, that's i like great. that uva study of students who were asked to sit alone in a room for 15 minutes percent who decided to give themselves a painful shock yeah that's <laughs> that doesn't surprise me that does not surprise me men and the level of like self stimulation that they need Within a within a short time frame, yeah, men are more restless than women. That, yeah, it's one of the traits that is most definitely a detriment to us. I, I mean, I, I get it. It I sounds stupid, but I get it. No, no, I get it too. <laughs> I mean, I'm it's not like if I'm just left there for a period of time, and they're like, "This button will shock you if you press it." I'm like, like fatally? No, 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 just a small shock. I'm like, oh. I'll be there for like five minutes when I... Mm -hmm. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. It's like, it's partially like, I gotta see if that's true, and just, I'm bored. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, all right. Oh, come on, don't pull the lads over. Ah. time. Hey, you laugh. Hell yeah. They <laughs> to get their six packs for 300. No joke, I'm pretty sure some of them were painted on. Yeah, sure. most of them are airbrushed. Most of them are fake. Tragedy has struck. How long has that one been in your family? Guys, check oh. out this sweet-ass cardboard tube someone was just going to throw away. Yeah, now you can make scary noises with it. Look at the sword Ooh. I found. Quick, you don't have much time. Okay, <laughs> what is... Ah! Oh. Another one. Another one. Look at that. A 4080, maybe for her, 4090 for him, and dude, the RS F1270? Dude! Son, son of a bitch! I'm just way more jealous of the girl, to be honest. Well, yeah. I, that's what I would, that's probably what I would be. That is, like, that is an attractive lady. That is a very attractive she, lady. She got it going on. Whew, yeah. Okay, let's move on before I... Is this? Is this like a genre of photos? Also, come on, bro. You bought a 4080? That's the embarrassing part. At least the other guy only got the 4090 and a PS5. The monitor and the 4090? Sure. But the 80? No. Dude, come on. Dude, I got a 3080 when I could have got a 3090. I'm more than content with my 3080. You don't need, you don't need the top end in order to, be a, to, order, in order to feel like a big dick badass. This ain't it, dog. Do I even need to explain? Honestly, I wouldn't mind you doing it. They all matched with the same girl on Tinder, so they decided to send her a group picture. Well, she's probably fake, so... Eh. <laughs> what you say? What's this stick doing in the trunk of your car? It's my stick. What kind of question is that? Uh, agreed. Yeah. It's like, if I have something in my truck, <laughs> there is a reason for it being there. It's like, why is there a stick back here? It's just like, it's like, it's my stick. It's like, why do you have a stick? It's my stick. I just like the phrasing. What kind of question is that? <laughs> yeah. It's just like, I'm sure, I guarantee you, if you looked in the back seat of my truck, you'd be like, dude, why are there four bricks in the floorboard of the back of your truck? I'm like... In case I need them for something. Well, no, no. There's actually a good reason behind it. Uh, they are actually bricks from my old high school that got demolished, and uh, I actually been meaning to give one of them to uh, some family members of mine who I haven't seen yet. So waiting for that. Yeah, check out this giant cardboard tube I found. What is with the tubes? A They're cool. Was a wild ride. Let's see. Oh, who did it? Who did what? What? Who did it? Where'd that come from? Give me a napkin quick. There's a turd floating through the air. <laughs> it ain't one of mine. I don't think it's one of mine. Mine was a little more sticky than that. Throw that away. God almighty. Oh my. <laughs> oh God. And I thought Apollo 13 was the most dangerous mission. 
God. Two guys <laughs> rearrange roadside Christmas decorations and proudly talk about it on Swedish TV. <laughs> oh, lovely. Is this why the Finns don't like the Swedes that much? Is this why? Mm, probably. You get arrested for that in America. Yeah, kind of like public indecency. Yep. That's stupid. We're supposed to be the free country. Yeah, ain't no free. <clears throat> ain't no freedom here anymore. Oh, God. So, yeah, that, that was uh, most definitely dudes being dudes, uh, or guys being dudes. And that's the right, most of that was the right kind of dudes. You know, the dude, you know, the one guy holding up the, you know, the paddle in front of his face while the dude, while he was throwing darts at, no, that is not, I do not recommend doing that. That's that just reminds me of freaking uh, Charlie McDennis, where it's like, uh, he has to hold his hand in front of the dart board while they throw darts at it without it flinching. Oof. And Frank, like, they keep missing, and then finally Frank throws it and hits him right in the middle of the hand, and he's just like... Nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Plays like the zen sound. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, you got a napkin, dude? Or paper towels or something? Because... Apparently I spilled, uh, there's drink I spilled on this somehow, so nope, I have nothing. Oh, well. Um, I'll, I'll figure it out here in just a second. But, <laughs> yeah, that's, like, that's unfortunate that, uh, you know, it, it, oh. it, oh, yeah, I see it. Yeah, thank you. Oh, shit. Technical difficulty. Technical difficulties. Hopefully it doesn't F up the keyboard like it did to mine. Well, if it does, I'll just run it through the dishwasher. <laughs> yeah, it works, actually. And it does, yes. Something that you see on the internet that actually does work. It actually is successful. <sighs> okay. So yeah, uh, we managed to uh, get the the liquid off the keyboard. Hopefully, there's no long term damage. But uh, yeah, hopefully y'all enjoyed this. I know I did. I mean, it, most of this in this was just like, ah, oh, that's just that's just cool. So until next time, everybody. Signing off. I'm Nate. I am Nick. See you later, everybody. Peace. <laughs>